Friday, guys. Mavericks Avengers here, and I do not why know why I move my hands around so much for like this. I have no idea why, but for some reason I feel like doing it. We have a Avalanche Outdoor Survival Kit, 13 pieces included. Essential survival tools, according to it, and also it's a water resistant pouch, not a waterproof pouch. So, yeah. So, if you do get one of these, this is not waterproof. This is water resistant. Um, and I don't know if this video will be out, but I opened up an Ar uh, Ozark Trail, and I don't, I think it says a waterproof, so, yeah. Okay, you get a flashlight, ghost stick, matches, emergency blanket, a rain poncho, a signal mirror, a compressed washcloth, a whistle, a knife, a fire starter, you get kindling and flint, and you get a compass. So, let's get into this real quick. Let's see. What are you? Oh, okay. So I was doing something kind of weird. I was trying to turn on the camera because it was catting kind of weird. Ooh, okay. You get bubble wrap too. Okay. You also, let's get everything out, okay. You get, the, what is this? Oh, it's the whistle. Okay, that's the whistle for that. Okay, this is the matches, of course, and the waterproof tight. Oh, that's pretty cool. You get one, two, three, four, five, six, about 20. 20, I think, around 20. Okay. What is this? This is a... Yeah, oh, to buckle onto your bag, I guess. Or whatever you're carrying, it's just a little knife. Right there, and then you mash right here to undo it. Okay, I paid $15 for this thing, too. So, yeah, as much as the Ozark Trail. Hmm. Alright, what are you... Oh, a signal mirror. What's wrong with the anchor? Let's see. So let's use the knife. Might as well. We need to test it out anyway. Let's test out the knife real quick. Mm, pretty sharp. Okay, yep, that is a signal mirror, I guess. Or it could be like a fire starter. In the right hands, I guess. It kind of looks like a glass. Let's close the knife real quick before I stab myself with it. Okay, what are you? You are... God, this thing has a lot of weird stuff in it. Stuff I've never seen before. Uh, yeah, you, that was a signal mirror. Uh, this is the flint starter, I guess. The fire starter and flint. A little weird looking thing. Alright. I've never had one like that before. We have the compass right here. North, south, west, east. Normal compass, as you can see. Okay, let's see what else we got. Oh, there's a poncho too. I didn't see that. Yeah, there's a poncho, a rain poncho too. Emergency rain poncho. Of course, I'm not gonna put it on because it's a rain poncho. One size fits all. Just like a normal would be super huge. What are you in the back? Just a little piece of paper, like a cardboard. Not even paper, it's cardboard. So some random. They just to keep the bag open, looking. Okay, we have another. We have flashlight. Let's see how this one does. Uh huh. Might have to untwist it. Just some weird looking matters. There we are. It had a little thing to block it so it wouldn't come on until you done that. So let's put it back on. And it still ain't coming on. What am I doing wrong? What the heck? There's something I'm doing wrong. I don't know what the... Oh, the spring fell out. That's what it is. Okay. I was wondering what the heck happened. Somehow the spring fell out and I didn't see it. I'm an idiot, like normal. Nothing new. Okay. Let's see how bright this thing is. Mm, that's in my shadow and it is not bright at all. So, not, the flashlight is not good. <laughs> Would not get it for the flashlight. That is basically what I'm saying. Okay, then we have the compressed washcloth. Only one with this one. The Ozark Trail one gave me two, I mean eight, so that one went in by that. 
the glow stick, which is just like a normal glow stick. You gotta break it and everything, just like normal. Okay, and then we have a emergency blanket. If you don't know what this looks like, this is the exact same one as I got in the uh, $10, what was it called? The $10, the other survival kit I done, it will be in the top right or in the description one. Go look at it. This has, that's what the emergency blanket would look like. I'm not going to open it up because it took me a hard time to put the other one up. Um, and like I said, it's a water resistant pouch. Isn't, are you serious? They put holes in it. God almighty. This, look, I don't know if I can see this. You can see this on camera. Move my line a little bit closer. Right there. Yeah, you can see it right there. Right there. They put two holes in it where they put the backs on. Okay. I hate saying this. I did not know this. I really thought this would be a great, a great freaking survival kit. I would highly advise you not getting this. In my opinion, that's just my opinion on it. I do not like it. I mean, first of all, they put holes in the pouch, okay? Then they give you a compressed towel, which again, you can get one at Walmart for the Ozark Trail one for uh, $15 and get eight of them, okay? You get a glow stick, which I don't know why you need a glow stick. If you have a flashlight, that's worth two cents, which this one is not. You have a signal clean, a signal clean mirror. I don't know how good it is. works in terms of a mirror. Okay, we have an emergency poncho, which I mean, it is good to have a poncho. Uh, this, which probably is extremely hard to light. You have a whistle that actually works, and that is something that Walmart did not give uh, did not give you the whistle worked, but it was not the loudest in the world. A little teeny compass instead of putting it and mounting it right here. That would be a great place to put it right there or on the bottom. Something. I mean, there's a grooves right here, like it should have went on the bottom. If I was somebody that bought this, I would put this glue it down to the bottom. That's just my opinion on it. Um, yeah. Oh, I know. Um, but that about does it for this kit, guys. Um, like I said, I paid fifteen dollars for this right there. Fifteen dollars, fifteen dollars avalanche outdoor survival kit. Yeah. But uh, anyways, guys, if you like this video, let me wasting my money. Uh, give this video a like, subscribe to my channel, hit that little bell beside it, and comment down below if you want to see more survival kits. I love opening up survival kits and little stuff like this. One of my favorite things to do. But uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye. Hey guys, Maverick's Adventures here, and today we, Max, me and Max are looking through survival kit stuff. I was showing him stuff in it because he's interested in it. And I went back to the flashlight, as you can see. I don't have the light on, so you can't see it. Never mind. Um, but uh, if you turn the thing slowly, you get a little, oops, you get the little dim light like I had. Or, for some reason, I ain't doing it now, but uh, this is out of the avalanche. Uh, I guess I know. Um, yeah, but see how it's a lot brighter now? It was not like that last night. I guess because I turned it a little slowly or something. I have no idea. But now it's pretty bright. See, that's what it normally looks like. It's pretty bright. Compared to the Ozark Trail, uh, about the same as Ozark and some of the other flashlights you normally would get. So, yeah. Back with that.